Hi, my name's Tony Ridley and welcome to a brief overview and book review of The Zappos Experience by Joseph Michelli. Um, this is a great book. You know, the book articulates what many people have known, both from a customer and certainly from an employee aspect, of why Zappos is such a success story and why it's a fantastic place to work. And the book takes you through the five key elements in which they articulate and how they came about from such small, humble beginnings to the large organisation they are and how they maintain and preserve this. So the first aspect that, that touches on is how they're, they're serving a a relevant service to an individual that's made a request. And it's not just about shoes, it's the expectation, it's the delivery, it's the processing, it's the understanding the customer that they go to great lengths and it's certainly articulated very very well in the book. And for them, it's all about the culture. It's the culture of the organisation and and they're extremely selective, uh, if not uh, discriminatory, in terms of how they make sure that the individuals can assimilate their type of customer because it resonates through the entire organisation. And for them, it's an action, it's a doing word, it's a verb, and it's something that uh, proliferates through the organisation from the very beginnings all the way through to the the, uh, the delivery and certainly the follow-up of um, services after a purchase as well. And for them, it's all about speed and velocity and, and making it effortless. Um, you know, to ensure that you know, the minimal amount of interface for customers, you know, to simplify it, to ex- streamline and, and uh, you know, give people a reason to keep coming back so it's, uh, it's an easy process. It's consumption, it's junk food, it's takeaway, it's easy, it's convenient. Um, and again, it goes through all of the processes and the systems and the training and, the, um, and, and all these other aspects within the, the book and it's a very, very easy read and there's a number of other added bonuses in the book in terms of how they're assimilated and links to some of the online processes as well. Um, and for them, it's all about understanding not only the product and the process, but also the requirement and the intent of the customer. And they're constantly surprised. And there's some fantastic stories throughout the book in terms of the, the above and beyond service uh, deliveries that have been uh, implemented by their staff um, and the speed in which they go about it. And certainly, they don't profess to, to do everything perfect and they've gone to great pains to have quality assurance, quality control, but also they acknowledge that, that when they do make mistakes and that this is handled in much the same manner, if not significantly better. And, and again, it goes to, to great lengths. Um, you know, making this personal and contextual to ensuring that the individual is catered to. So it's not a one-size-fits-all at all. It's, it certainly goes down to the individual's demographic, genders, locations, requirements... Um, and they don't treat customers as simply walking uh, ATM, cash machines, um, you know, and coin dispensers. You know, it, it is really a personalised process, and and they do, you know, they they do as they they um, that they pontificate uh, as they uh, talk about, and that is connecting at all levels and making sure that you know everything from the the point of entry with the organisation all the way up to the executives are all focused on the customer and, and ensuring that all customers are treated with. Uh, with equal clarity and consistency, and constantly improving. You know, they've gone from humble beginnings to you know, centre of excellence, and they've done many things right, and, and they've achieved significantly and grown their market shares. Um, and as a result, they've under, had an underpinning process in terms of how they educate with the consistencies. But this is, again, by no means a carved in stone process. It's constantly changing, constantly evolving. And it certainly sets the, sets the benchmark for a lot of other organisations because the, uh, the underpinning element throughout the entire book is that it really isn't a conventional business model. Um, it, it's not filled with rules and regulations and focusing on the 1% of things that will go wrong and punishing the 99% of people that, that uh, deviate or, or think as adults and, and uh, humans. It, it really is about creating a community and it really does focus on how they've made a culture in terms of uh, giving freedom of action and, and giving the, the, the general spirit so as everybody's swimming in the same direction. And for them, it's much more than just shoes. It's not uh, they're not being cobblers uh, exclusively. It's about a whole experience. And and again, um, when you measure this against conventional businesses or many other businesses, online or offline, uh, it's a very enviable outcome. And and the question is, why are not more businesses like that? Um, and and they're growing as a result and continue to grow. And for them, it's not a case of of getting involved in something simply to partake. It's about a centre of excellence. It's about improving. It's about being you know, the best they can be um, in all, all areas. But when they do it, they, they play. You know, there's, there's a lot of enviable stories and you hear 
lots of cliches about coloured bean bags and little work pods and all those sorts of things and dress up days but um, they really do seem to have a sense of uh, jocularity in the workplace and the rolling around on the floor laughing aspect really does sound very enviable having worked in far too many conventional organisations um, it really is a, a point of envy um, and they, they still manage to control it they still manage to produce the results and they do all of the aspects of, of standard businesses but they devi deviate significantly and they get, certainly do get superior results. So I highly recommend the book. The book goes into, as I said, significant detail. It serves up a, an easy to read format. Um, it touches on all of the main elements and it, it also offers some of the links to the online uh, you know, with a number of QR codes and a number of other little uh, uh, sidebars, which is great. You know, having navigated all of them and read through the book, I highly recommend this, particularly for people who are looking to reinvigorate the workplace, to explore the the uh, significant, uh, extraordinary, unique aspects of business, and get away from the, the boring old routine type stuff, and and see how they get results. Highly recommended. Um, and once again, thanks. <laughs>